Good afternoon class. Welcome to our today's revision. Question from ratio and proportion. In a school of 2,400 pupils, the ratio of boys to girls was 3 is to 5. During the year, the number of boys increased in the ratio 3 is to 2. And that of girls decreased in the ratio 3 is to 4. So, boys increased, girls decreased. So, what we are going to do first, to answer the question, what was the new enrollment of all pupils, we are first of all going to calculate the initial number of each case. Initial number of boys, initial number of girls. So, we start with boys. We want to know how many boys were there initially. So, we are told the ratio of uh, boys to girls was 3 is to 5. To get a fraction of boys, we are going to take this 3 and we put it over the sum 3 uh, plus 5. Because the ratio 3 is to 5 means that in every 8 pupils, in every 8 pupils in the school, 3 were boys and 5 were girls. Therefore, the fraction of boys remains 3 over 8. So to get the number of boys, we multiply by the total number of boys uh, pupils in the school, which is 2,400. So we multiply, we divide by 8, 1, by 8, 300. Multiply 300 times 3, we get 900. So we had 900 boys in the school initially. Let us see how many girls were there. So girls, the fraction of girls was 3 over 8. Uh, not 3 but 5 because this is for boys. So the uh, fraction of boy of girls was 5 over 8. So we multiply by 2400. So we want to know how many girls we are there initially by 8, 1, by 8, 300. 300 times 5, you normally get 1,500. So these were the girls who were in the school initially. So when the boys increased in the ratio 3 is to 2, how many, what was their new number? We want to see how many boys uh, were they after they increased in the ratio 3 is to 2. So to increase boys in the three, ratio 3 is to 2, we say 3 over 2 times their initial number, 900. So we multiply by 900 here. And we say by 2, 1, by 2, we get 450. So we say 450 times 3. We see we get their new number. 0 times 3. We get a zero. Three times five, we get fifteen. But one, twelve, we get thirteen. So, uh, the new number of boy, the new number of boys became one thousand three hundred and fifty. This was the new number of boys in the school. Let us see the new number of girls in the school. So the girls, we are told, they decreased. In this ratio, 3 is to 4. And their original number was 1,500. So, to reduce number uh, of girls, in the ratio 3 is to 4. We say 3 over 4 times their initial number, which is 1,500. Like that. <clears throat> and we divide here by 2, we get 2. Here by 2 get 7, 50. By 2, 1. By 2 here we get 3, 75. So we say 3, 75 times 3. This one. So by 5 times 3 you get 15. 7 times 3 you get 21. Plus the 1 carried you get 22. Carry 2. 3 times 9 
you uh, three times three you get nine plus two you get eleven so when girls decreased in the ratio three is to four they became their new number was one thousand one hundred and twenty five that is the new number of girls the question is asking what was the new enrollment of all pupils to get the new enrollment new enrollment we are going to uh, uh, to get the sum of the current number of boys plus the current number of girls so we are going to say 1350 plus 1125 so this one gives us the total enrollment the current enrollment so 0 plus 5 you get 5 5 plus 2 you get 7 3 plus 1 you get 4 2, 1 plus 1 you get 2 so the current number of pupils or the enrollment is 2475 that is how that equation is done we hope you have understood uh, we are going to do uh, much more on the ratio and the proportion in our coming uh, revision lessons so kindly follow subscribe and also comment let us meet in our next lesson thank you